Hmm? Huh? What was that? Clear. Nobody here. Excellent ride. Now I'm not very good at character action games. In fact, I'm pretty terrible. I can never remember the combos, I'm terrible at blocking, all that stuff. So I should probably play this on normal because I'll get my ass kicked otherwise. However, I've never actually played Metal Gear Rising on normal. I played the demo so much that I was a god by the time the game came out. So I played it on hard to begin with. But I don't think it would be very interesting for you guys at home if I just played through it on hard again, even though I've pretty much forgotten how the game plays. So maybe, maybe I should play very hard. That would be more of a challenge, right? But I still don't think that would be interesting enough for you guys. So maybe, as a crazy idea, we're gonna go Revengeance style. Oh yeah. Should I do it? Do I dare to live out the American dream? Fuck it. Now, this might be a stupid idea because this mode is so tough that people have actually stopped playing because it's just that difficult. You know, when I watched the two best friends play this, Pat was the one who was playing the game and he's great at action games, he's a big fan of them, and he picked normal, which was so disappointing. He just breathed through the game like it was nothing. Three years. We've come so far in just three short years. The sign of a strong leader, sir. Yeah, it's actually been four years oh, since the end of Guns of the Patriots, if you can believe it. So technically people. speaking, in this time, Solid Snake should be dead. He only had like, what, six or seven months to live? So in this era, he should be gone. And one very able advisor. Oh my god, you guys got a room. Thank you, sir. Thank you, son, sir. <laughs> goo goo. Your team deserves credit as well. I think I deserve most of the credit. Mr. Lightning Bolt. That's Mr. Pikachu to you. We're just doing our job, Mr. Prime Minister. And that is Quentin Flynn reprising the voice of Raiden, of and he does a good job. Opportunists, enablers of war. But you've trained our new army well. Order has returned sooner than expected. Perhaps I was wrong about these private military companies. Yep, PMCs are still a thing after the Guns of the Patriots. We prefer private security providers, sir. Raiden is now a bodyguard. Most of Maverick's contracts do focus on security. Yes, well, the security can mean many things. Raiden looks a tad weird here in his normal outfit. You can even see where they stitch his body back together with the cyber There's part. There's a saying I like. One sword keeps another in the sheath. Sometimes the threat of violence alone is a deterrent. It is. Sometimes by taking a life, others can be preserved. That's true. Unfortunately, not as true as we'd all hope. It's the code the samurai lived by. These guys are like, oh my god. Mm. So it's you mean you're a weeaboo, Mr. Raidenovich? You are full of surprises, Mr. Lightning Bolt. I could say the same about you, Mr. Prime Minister. Raiden looks like one of those pretty boys you see in Japan. Why are we stopping? What is happening? Someone's blocking a lead vehicle. Hold on. Courtney, get out there and push. Clear the road! This is official state business! All these guys are cyborgs. Why wouldn't you though? In this future, everybody has cybernetic implants because they're just so fucking badass. Speaking of asses, if I ever had to get my butt replaced, I would want this guy's ass. That is one amazing blade. Just the color alone is amazing, but it looks powerful enough to take down gods. Great shooting there, Tex! One thing you're gonna notice about this game is that it doesn't waste any of your time. Cutscenes especially. Holy bejesus! Now, technically, these guys this person is fucking up, they are cyborgs, but they are still human beings too. Like Raiden. Parts of them are human, but for the most part, they're probably all cyborgs. Although these guys, these ones look more human. And in case you're wondering what year this game takes place, it's set in the far off future of 2018. And just like Ocelot said at the end of MGS4, the world has pretty much turned into like the Wild West. But with ninjas. Now that's the face of a troll. Open fire! Who was that? A cyborg. One of our competitors? Courtney, what is happening? We got hit, sir. A cyborg. I really doubt in the future tablets will be that chunky. I really doubt it. Exit comes up. 
located. I'll notify all checkpoints. Get all money out of there. Yes, sir. This is a good start to a game. Fuck. How the hell? That should have blown us up, surely. Oh, nodes. Grunty cyborgs. Why didn't we hire cyborgs except for Raiden? We only have one cyborg? That's crazy. Okay, this is all, this is really well planned out. I got a feeling we're fucked. We are going to die. Well, you are. I'm not. Get us the fuck out of here. Drive away, quick. I'm pretty sure Raiden's sword could cut through those barriers. In fact, I'm pretty sure Raiden's sword could cut through just about anything in the entire world if it wanted to. Actually, think about it now. How the hell does Courtney survive this? I know she survives, but how? It would seem like she'd get picked off pretty easily. He's got friends on our 12. You mean in front of us? I'm on it. Guard the Prime Minister. It's time for me to be a badass. Okay, I don't believe that for one second. There was not even a ripping sound. You're not a Yakuza. Look at this awesomeness. How does that work? Magnets. This is basically everybody's dream who saw him fight in Guns of the Patriots come to life. High frequency blade. Been rocking this thing since Mel Gibson saw the two. Oh shit. Oh, you're giving them a way out. Good. You want to get to them? You gotta go through me. Let's get this over with. Oh yes. And he's wearing the same suit from Metal Gear Solid 4. Nice. So let's see how I do. It's been a long time. Oh fuck, there's a gecko already. Let's do this thing then! Oh, you got nothing over there, baby! Fuck you! Oh shit! Oh. Oh no. I've never felt so wrong to pick a difficulty in my life. But you know, we're gonna keep going. I'm sure we can get through this. I'll just mash them. Okay! Okay, that gecko can kill me in one hit. That's great. Shit! Okay, the gecko just stomped on me. It crushed me from out of nowhere. I couldn't even see the fucking thing. I can do this. Fuck you! It's all my word. One hit, half down. Half down. I just need to learn how to parry. Parry is everything in this game. Okay, that was not that. The gecko's gonna charge me! You can block, but it's only for a short period of time. Fucking son of a bitch. I'm sure I can do this, though. I'm pretty sure I can do this. I mean, if I can't get past this first fucking encounter, the whole game is gonna be a nightmare. Although, this is the first act. Oh, shit. Oh, come on! This is the start. The first encounter. I can't get past it. Get back here! Oh, you fuck! How do I attack everything? They're hitting me from every side! I told you I sucked at these games! Boy, picking revenge mode was a smart idea. Idea of the fucking year. Come on, guys! Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh. Yeah, you're probably not going to believe this, but I actually did complete the whole game in Revengeance once upon a time without taking any damage at all, basically, in S ranks all over the place. How? I don't know. I guess I just played the game that much, but holy shit, this is tough. This is so fucking difficult! Oh! Oh, it sweeped the leg and fucked me up. I think I've died like nine times. You know what? I have an idea. I just figured it out. You know what I'll do? Oh, shit! I'm gonna run away! <laughs> I'll just run to the next section. What? What? No! I have to fight them? This is not an encounter I could skip? I have to. Oh! Uh, there's no choice! Yes! No! One of them sliced me in the back. Oh, fine. You're getting fucked now. On your own? Oh, you son of a whore! There's so many fucking things I can't see! God, there's so many attacks, they're non-stop, man! Oh, it's gonna charge me! Ah, yeah, baby! Thrills of nature! I can beat- Oh, you goddamn motherfucker! <laughs> and you know what, this is supposed to be a short game. I'm starting to feel like on Revenge's difficulty, it might be a bit longer. Oh, God, there we go! Oh, fuck, my parry missed every single fucking last one of them. Oh, shit, did you see that? No, it's about to die! I need to get it! Oh, fucking leave me alone, you prick! Oh, you're f fucking. I had done it too. I did it! <laughs> These are like the easiest grunts in the game, and I can't beat them. Oh, for fuck's sake! Let's see what you got! Okay, this is it. Hold on. Where's that paste on the ground? That gives me no health! Oh, you son of a bitch! Ah! I think I may have bitten off more than I could chew, Take I think's the term. Because I definitely feel 
like this is like a mountain I'm trying to climb over here and I'm just not going to be able to. Okay, watch out. It's coming for me! Fuck. I, what? Huh? I turned the full 180 degrees. Will you give me a chance? Oh, shit. Okay, did I just... Oh, no. Okay, I think I'm up to 20 plus attempts in this one little act. I know what you're thinking. Maybe you should put it down to the lower difficulty, Sapcom. Nah, that ain't my style. I I can do it. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> They're so quick with their moves. I'm getting no chance to counterattack here. It's fucking crazy. I wish I could bunch them all up together and do a parry, but it's not happening. He's dead! He's dead! They're both dead! I killed them all! Except for the gecko! You're gonna be a fucking easy one on your own, you son of a bitch! You thought you were so fucking cool when you were with your teammates, but now you're on your own, you're fucked! Oh, look at you backing up like a little baby! You can't beat me on your own! Can you? I'm gonna rip your fucking legs off! You hear me? You like that, don't you? Nah, no, you're not gonna get a chance. Yes! Feel my revenge! Do, do, do. I'm not fucking hitting it at all! No, don't let it hit you! Oh my god, I do not want to die. Oh, it's puking green blood or something. Ew. What kind of fucking oil is that? Fucking chop its limbs off! Oh, I can't do the mode. I can't do the cutting mode in this uh, opening act. I think it's only the second act onwards. Fuck off! Just die already! Die! I tell you what, that might have been tough as nails, but fuck does it feel good when you complete it. Nice car you got there. It would be a shame if something cut it. Now you have many cars. <laughs> this is the best feature in the game. Being able to slice everything up perfectly. It's why I wish to God there was a sequel, because nothing is as fun as slicing things. Look at that! It's to the nth degree perfect. Can I cut this tree? You're fucking right I can! Oh yes! Let's stress the PlayStation 3's processor with how many things it can handle on screen at one time. Look how many different particles there are! Oh! The frame rate's taking about... Oh shit! Where do I have to go? I need to get over there. Oh shit! Mr. Rocket Man, I'm gonna get you! Oh no I'm not. Oh shit! Really? I didn't remember there'd be wolves here, even on Revenge's mode! This is a bit much, isn't it? Don't you think? Okay. Okay. I hear you, game. The game's basically telling me, you ain't shit, son. Get good. And I'm like, okay. I don't have to restart th that first encounter, do I? Please. No. Please. Oh, hallelujah. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's just roll. Whoa. Let's run past these people. These things. Oh, shit. Just let's get over here. Get through the th thingy. Oh, thank God. They basically pushed me in there with a rocket launcher, but that's okay. Oh, these are the security guard cyborgs. So we did have a few more than just riding. That's good. Oh, these guys could do with even longer swords. Oh my god. Just like in MGS4, the hype cometh. That's That might be the coolest looking Metal Gear Ray variant I've seen. Even though it's unmanned, it's so good. It's so cool. And already, this is the game. This is the beginning of the game, and they're throwing a Metal Gear at us. That's fucking amazing. Metal Gear games always have good openings, and Ryzen is no different. Watch out there, fella. Oh, shit. Yeah, I can see why this game got an 18. Okay, now that guy, his swings look like they would cleave anything in half. Look like you could take off a horse's head without much effort. What the fuck? Oh, they're like scissors! Ooh. Oh my lord. This guy is basically Texas and 4chan combined into one. Can't wait to beat him. His suit's cool though. It looks like the suit out of Crisis on the PC. Except developed for a fatter person. Or larger body person. He's not really fat. He's built. So they're after this guy. This some president in some African country. Probably not even a real one, because they can't get involved in real world politics. But yeah. That's oh, a bitchin' suit. Stop! Stop! Not today. I'ma break you up, boy. Get down here and fight me. I'll kick your ass. I'm more ninja than you. 
So you're Jack. No, I'm the Lightning. What do you want with the Prime Minister? I want him dead. Well, kill him then. Just kill him right now. Nothing personal, of course. You could literally kill him without even trying. Africa's just getting a bit too peaceful. Oh, sure. What? <laughs> yeah, sure it is. Business ain't been the same since they shut down SOP. Ooh, I love how it's continuing some of the plot lines. A clean break from the war economy. Huh. Well, some of us lack that economy. How's an honest warmonger supposed to make a living? You look like you'd make a great baker. This is your answer. Yeah, Quentin <laughs> Flynn does a much more gravelly, sort of edgy Raiden than this one. Don't do it! But it fits. It suits Raiden's character. Don't worry now. I won't. Until later. Even though I could do it right now, it'd be pretty fucking easy. Not while he's still useful. Useful? What the fuck are you gonna use it for? I'm so mad. So long. No! Oh my god, they got those super lunky jumping legs. What? Oh shit. Now this is one of the most intimidating bosses you could ever encounter at the beginning of the game. But what an encounter, huh? I couldn't believe it the first time. I was like, really? You're just throwing a Metal Gray at me? Immediately? What the fuck? This should be pretty easy, right? I can defeat it. Fuck you! Ha! Huh. That's another one-hit kill monstrosity. All right then! Challenge accepted! Oh, if I remember correctly- Oh, shit! Oh, don't, please! Let me get away! Fuck! Okay, this thing's much more terrifying. It's crazy to think that Ryan took on a whole horde of Metal Gear Rays at the end of MGS2, but now this is just one, and it's kind of tough to take down. Although, as you can see, it's way more battle-hardened than before. What's it doing? Oh! What the fuck? Yes! It's a Death's Moon Blime! I got you. Cut from him everything, but take from him everything as well. No, don't touch me, please. Wow, I did not know you could parry that Metal Gear at the beginning here. I don't know what you're doing, but I don't care. Let me get to your foot. Your beautiful, beautiful foot. Ah, oh, yes. Come here, you fuck. Get over here! What? Yes! Slicey, slicey! I'm gonna take off her- Oh, I'm, I'm gonna take off all your fucking armor so fucking quick. Oh, this is so satisfying. This is the best fucking boss fight. Also, as fucking powerful as the Metal Gear Ray is here, it's severely outmatched. Because I'm so small, I can get down in between. Oh, shit. Oh! Okay. Fuck me. There's the leg, there's the leg. Sweep the leg! You can do it! Oh, Lord. One thing you're going to notice here is the music in the entire game... Oh! Is amazing. It had the soundtrack of 2013 for me, personally. But the songs, as good as they are, they get even better when the boss battles reach their crescendo. You'll see what I mean. But they are just, they're wonderful. They're inspired masterpieces, every single one of them. Every single song for the main boss battles in this game is a favorite of mine. And this one that's playing here for this Metal Gear Ray, this Metal Gear Ray theme. Oh shit, it's gonna come at me. Reflection! Oh, bitch! Oh, yes! How you feel about you being now, you son of a fuck? Taking down all your shit. Oh! You tried to get me, did you? Fuck you. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Almost! Fuck! So close! Oh, yes! Oh, I am completely demolishing this thing. I'm taking it apart! One piece at a time. Oh, it's so fucking fantastic. You've got no idea how good this feels. Especially on Revengeance. Difficulty knowing that every single shot could probably kill you in one hit. Oh, it's gonna rush me again. hey -ya booyah Vzoom! Fuck. I want to look at the markings on it. Look at the markings. Oh, it's so cool. Red and black. It's the best color pairing ever. Ever. It's so fucking gnarly. I want to destroy you so much. It's even got the tail. So it's the, it's the most upgraded version of a Metal Gear Ray you could probably find. Jesus Christ, that was close. Okay, it's got 10% health left. Come on, take it down there, ready boy. You can do it. Yes! Oh, I've still got more of these fucking turrets on its legs. I thought we'd taken it all off. God, this thing is fucking tough. Come on, come on. Ugh, what are you doing? 0.1% health. 0.1%. I got you. I don't remember how I take it down. Do I have to... No, don't parry that. Don't even think about parrying that. That's a bad idea. No, don't charge your laser. Let me get close to you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, don't parry it. Quick time event. Yes! Do you feel the power? 
and listen to that music kick in. Listen to the lyrics! Yes! Oh, fuck, you can feel the weight behind that thing. Ugh. Slice, 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 slice! Wait, wait, oh, Lord. That feeling, that alone is better than most games in their entirety. That feeling you get, it's, it's indescribable. Oh, I cut my arm again. Don't tell anybody. Your suit looks so beautiful, right? It's all completely patched up and all sparkly new. It's He's on awesome. the other side of that building. I fucking did this. Oh, yes. On Revenge of Difficulty 2! You know, there's a reviewer on YouTube I like called Jeremy Jans, who has no intention of playing this game because he says he doesn't like the fact that Raiden is having to fight again. He thought Raiden had a great story uh, closure for MGS4, and he thinks it's wrong that Raiden comes back and has to, you know, go on another adventure. I think it's great, though, because basically in this one, he's just a security guard. I mean, he had to do something as a job, right? So it makes sense he would use his cybernetic abilities to become a security guard. It's not like he meant to get involved in this, you know, whole drama ordeal. He was just wanting to use his abilities to protect people. I really wish he did play it though, because Jeremy Jans does some really good reviews on the whole Metal Gear Solid series, and they line up pretty much identically with how I feel. All this, all this is where the Metal Gear ripped through with the laser. Where'd that fucker go? He should have gotten pretty far since I fought that Ray for a long time. Oh, he's not that far, fat fucker! I knew he wouldn't be able to. <laughs> Use your ninja van to move over obstacles automatically. Why is he bothering to take this guy in the first place? He should have just killed him. Where you going, baby? Think you can run away from me? I wish there were more sections like this, just running straight flat out. That would have been great. What? Fuck out of the way! Yes. Nothing can stop the swords. <laughs> oh, taking the stairs is for human beings. I'm normies. I'm not normal. What? Uh, another one? Another one? How many did you bring? Wait a minute. I only cut off its arm. I thought we split it in half. Well, that's bullshit. Okay, 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 okay. You want something, you got something. Oh, shit. I don't know how to... I don't remember how to beat this one. Wait, 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 wait. Ugh. Fuck you, buddy. You got nothing. Ooh. Come on, freak. This is such a fantastic boss fight. Oh, no. You almost got me. Ha! Fuck you! What the fuck? I'm cutting away its mask! It's it's outer armor! Oh shit! I'm so fucking glad that whoever decided to use Metal Gears in the future is using the Metal Gear Rays. And to the and the Gecko as well. What? What? What's happening? Use blade mode? To take down those blade mode? <laughs> slicey slice! Oh, you didn't fucking touch me! And you thought you could kill me! You didn't know. Fuck, look at all those different pieces. I could slice that all day long. Look at the... Fuck you! The only thing, I wish we got a sequel, because it would have improved the physics so much. Yes, it's fallen! Smash it to pieces! Come on, Raiden, it's almost down! Uh, uh, uh. What, 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 what? Oh, you better believe it, baby! Look at me go! Oh man, Platinum Games, thank you so much for saving this project. Because if it weren't for them, we would have never gotten Metal Gear Rising to begin with. Slice, slice. And smoosh! Oh my god. I fucking disarmed you completely now. You're fucked. That's a boss ball. That's how you do it, kids. Oh shit! No! And hand me, you fiend! What? I don't think that looked like it was hard enough to throw me into that clock tower, but I don't care. Just when you think, nah, that, that, we couldn't get more hype, it gets more hype. Oh shit. Firing rockets and lasers? How the fuck, man? You didn't, you really think that's gonna stop me? You gotta try hard in the net, Ray, my boy? Hmm. I'm gonna cleave you in two. Right down the fucking tail as well. That's beautiful. That's fucking beautiful. Look at who, look at this character here. He came from the whiniest bitches ever. No damage! Fuck yes! That a single fucking hit? Well, I guess I couldn't take a hit, because it's like one hit death, no, pretty much. Why don't you just hop everywhere with those amazing frog legs of yours? Why are you lumbering around, you fat ass? They shoot him, guy! What are you waiting for? Oh, you can't shoot him because I'm the president. Fair enough. What's your plan here? 
run him down or something. Oh wow, every every villain in this game pretty much has a shit-eating grin moment. Yeah, if he could do that, he would never be able to be caught. Well, looks like our job's over, guys. We fail. But no, Ryan's got to save the day. I like the scene when he turns here and he just grabs it. Oh, oh, oh Lord, that's orgasmic. That's just the best. I wish there was a lot more free running, and I wish that you could run on walls in the actual game. You could. They actually added it in the game, but then they removed it for some reason. Maybe it made the game too easy. I don't know. But it was in the game at one point. He's headed for the front of the train. Oh, train scene. It's a very short train scene as far as I remember though. The game itself is extremely short from what I remember. It's like less than 10 hours long. An unidentified tilt rotor is headed your way. Keep an eye out for it. Tilt rotor? You mean a helicopter? That thing? I know, I saw. <clears throat> I don't know why I did that. Everything can be cut! Everything! Oh, yes! Get out of the way, boxes! No! Prime Minister! Prime Minister? Is he like a Prime Minister? Who cares then? I thought he was like a king or like a president. Huh. Prime Ministers are nothing. Too little too late, hero. Why did you bother to tie him up? I won't be needing my little seal here any longer. Oh, you needed him as a shield? Really? With your armor? Oh, I got it. Oh, that looks fucking atrocious. Fuck! That's awful. You can even see how hot the blood was. There was steam almost coming out of it. What about all the good things war has done for us? Why don't we ever hear speeches about that? Jobs, technology, oh. a common purpose. Uh. Raiden, forget me. Stop him. Okay. I have a feeling, though, I'm going to be able to forget about you very quickly. You ain't listening. Oh, how did you not cut off his hands? It looked like you should have. Oh, whoa, no! Fuck your quick mariachi man. I got in? I actually do. I want to get to sundown. Oh, you're saying? Give war a chance! I like the fact that even though it's a whole different team handling the game, the socio-political commentary of no. Metal Gear hasn't been abandoned. Oh, boy. I don't... Okay, fuck. That's brutal. You didn't even give him, like, half a decent send-off. Pest riding off. This is not a good idea. <laughs> You're gonna ride in that thing? I'm pretty sure if you try to get your fat ass up there, it'll probably tilt over. Get out of the way, fam! <laughs> wow, one hit and he's pushed you back so far. He's all yours, Sam. Bastard. Oh, here we get Sam's theme now. Let's go. Which is also one of the best themes of the game. Oh shit. You wanna fuck with me, boy? I don't think he attacks you until you attack first. Don't be shy. He's a gentleman and a scholar. In that way. <laughs> Boom, bitch! Oh shit! Oh wait a minute. Wait a minute! He was hurting me even when I was blocking! Self-taught. And not half bad. I'm not better than you. Still. Hey, you've got a scar. Oh! Wow, dude. Fuck me, man! Biden is severely outmatched here. Maybe if I had that muscle suit armor he has. What? No, my technique is flawless. Oh! Are you kidding me? Wait, what? 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 No. I'm at 0.1% health? No, I can't. I can't. I can't lose. I mustn't lose. To you. Uh, unfortunately, I think this is a fight. Holy shit. He's right in the walls. This isn't a fight you can win. But, I don't, I mean, I don't know if you can win, but you're meant to lose. Oh, the mighty! Fucking hell, son. God doesn't fuck around. His sword is cooler than Raiden's, though. Oh, you deny your weapon its purpose. What? What are we talking about? Oh, my God. That's Raiden's real eye. That's not a cybernetic eye. That's his real eye. It yearns to bathe in the blood of your enemies. But you hold it back. No. Actually, yes, you're right. Ugh. My sword is a tool of justice. No, it's not. You don't understand. I mean, you see! The cutscenes in this are extremely brief, 
Oh boy, are they well directed. Wow! Hartman, please nerf jet stream sound. Please nerf. Considering the time constraints and the budget that this game had, which wasn't very much to begin with, it's amazing that what Platinum came up with. Oh? Oh yes, this technique is so fucking amazing. The legendary ejaculating sword technique of Brazil. It launches it from its guard to speed up the attack. Oh boy. This, just like every first mission in Metal Gear, things have got to go fucking completely wrong. Although this is a, this is really bad. Wow, I hope that's not your blood. Shit, not again. <laughs> oh yeah, it's the same arm you lost to Metal Gear Solid 4. Are you all right? I'm fine. You're almost clear of the tunnel. Just hang on. I get this guy on the ropes. Give up, Sam. You have no chance. <clears throat> oh my God, Ryden. Did you want to practice first? Peace has defeated you. Gotta try hard on that. You know, this is not really that fair. The before, I mean, oh, wow. Were you blocking me? What's the point? Come here, you fuck. Did you want to practice first? I did actually. You're pretty rude for not letting me practice. Fuck off! No! Did you want to practice first? No! Ah! As far as building up a reason for Raiden to want to take revenge, this is a good way to do it. This is what happens when you bring a tool to a sword fight. I'm not a tool, you're a tool. You tool. It's over. No, it's only just because. Well, it would be over, but since you're taking about 10 years to actually finish me off, I think I'm going to get a reprieve any moment now. <laughs> Lucky devil. <laughs> you really could, you literally could have killed me at any point there. You have plenty of time for this guy swings his gun around easy. You can deflect those size of bullets? No, I don't think so. What? You get to say that line? Seriously? Boris? The nobody? You're not even gonna give it to Ryan or something? It's so mean. I'm running away, huh? Scared of. Huh. I'm bleeding. Making me the victor. Oh, uh, that's right. Fuck off, like Landy. You know, if we took that helicopter or whatever it's called down, we would be able to save us the rest of the game. Come on, Boris. Aim true. Down you go! I like that he actually attempts to do that. And not just gives up or Flash. whatever. Fuck! Come on. Fire some more rockets, guys. Keep firing! They can't have unlimited flares. Quickly! Before it turns around the mountain! Oh! Fuck. I'm glad he at least attempted it, though. If he just gave up, that would have been bullshit. I will have my revengeance! And yes, I'm sure you're all wondering, is revengeance even a real word? It is, actually. In fact, it's a really, really old-ass real word. From the 15th century, in fact. And that was the first chapter. There's not many chapters in the game. It's only like, I think, six or seven or so. So there's barely any. That only took 19 minutes. 25 kills. Wait a minute. I got an S rank? The whole thing, I got an S rank. Okay, I'll take it. I'm kind of fucking shocked. That was a great opening act. But as good as it was, I got my ass handed to me quite a bit. I got a feeling the rest of the game's going to be just as brutal. Thank you. I, I will not forget this. You're right, you won't. Get back here, you son of a bitch. Right. What are you doing? 